Chip and Joanna Gaines were embroiled in a drama even when they were not responsible for it because of one of the shows on Hometown. By now, you must be well aware of the Candace and Andy Meredith and their show Homework that features in the new Magnolia Network was pulled off due to some controversy. Multiple homeowners have reportedly raised their voice against the incompetent works of Meredith's on their property, forcing Magnolia to pull off the show just days after it was released on TV in early January. However, it had been available on the streaming platforms for months since the end of 2021. Magnolia Network is aware that certain homeowners have expressed concerns about renovation projects undertaken by Candace and Andy Meredith. Allison Page, the president of Magnolia Network, revealed in a statement back then. Within the last few days, we have learned additional information about the scope of these issues, and we have decided to remove homework from the Magnolia Network lineup pending a review of the claims that have been made. Candy and Andy have kept denying all the allegations against them most of which include complaints of going over the allotted budget and time as well as multiple unsafe work environments and renovations. They have said that some of these claims were hurtful. So many believe that we are frauds, have hurt people intentionally, and that we are not who we say we are. That is simply not true. They stated and also once opened up about how they were being attacked emotionally and psychologically because of them. They also eventually share their sides of the story to all the homeowners' claims. Aubrey Bennion was the first because she was the one to go public with these allegations first and the rest of Meredith's former clients poured in. She had claimed that the couple promised her they would renovate her kitchen, her wildest of dreams, at just $20,000 and within a few weeks, even though she didn't even think it could be done at $50,000. But the fact that they were part of a Magnolia show gave her some reassurance, only for them to take many months to complete the task and ask her for almost $50,000 for it. The Merediths agree that it did take them a little longer and they went over the budget at around $45,000 in total, but they have so far only made her pay $13,000 because of the trouble. We pay that difference of approximately $32,000 personally. After paying so much out of pocket and upon receiving a letter of demand from the Hollies around the same time, we were advised not to spend another penny of our own funds towards our raised renovations, they shared. As she states herself, she was prepared to pay another $6,000 allegedly, and she paid the half remaining balance for Lemco Flooring from that. We told Lemco Flooring over the phone of the situation, and they were aware. They also responded to another client, Jeff Hawley, who threatened to sue the couple if they did not put in his counters, but the homework hosts say that putting in the counters was never a part of their deal. It seems they were able to prove their innocence enough, as just a few days after being pulled off the air, Chip and Joanna Gaines reportedly put the show back on Magnolia as of January 13 as per deadline. It is this association that has made Chip and Joanna linked to the scandal. Other unhappy clients of the Merediths, Fina and Robert Coates, said that they were shooed away when they asked the Magnolia Network for help long before the allegations went public. The Merediths were also likely handpicked by the Gaineses as Andy told people previously how he got a message from Joanna Gaines on Instagram about the idea for a show long before it was formally approached by Magnolia. Let's hope the Chip and Joanna know what they are doing and who they are endorsing in this controversy.